Oh man, L D M M A C. What did I tell y'all? What did I tell y'all? I told y'all Nate Diaz would win this fight. Listen, man, the commentary was so far up Anthony Pettis' ass, you would have thought that he was having a bowel movement. Man, look, Nate Diaz, not only did he win this fight, he went in here, he took Anthony Pettis to school. He whooped Anthony Pettis' ass in there, man. <laughs> Anthony Pettis couldn't do anything. Nate Diaz smothered this dude the whole night, made Anthony Pettis fight his fight in the phone booth. Made Pettis fight his fight. Nate Diaz beat this boy, and I'm talking about beat him like he never been beat before, man. Nate Diaz ain't even, man, look, I think Nate Diaz got like a, a small cut. One small cut, that's it. Other than that, man, he got his ass whooped. Showtime Pettis said he was going to do this. Showtime Pettis said he was going to do that. But when the rubber meets the road, he couldn't do a damn thing. Let's get that ass whooped. Round one, you know, this fight was entertaining throughout the whole bout, man. Uh, you know, Nate Diaz was doing a very good job of countering uh, Anthony Pettis. Anthony Pettis was trying to do that highlight reel stuff, and I kept telling people that's not going to work, man. Nate Diaz is smart, man. He's not going to get caught like that, man. He's too smart for Pettis. Pettis is just like he's a one-hitter quitter, man. And he load up on that one strike, and that's it. And I knew that this fight would go this way. I knew that Nate Diaz was going to punish this dude. Nate Diaz punished him, man. Put him up against that fence and just started beating the hell out of him. I'm talking about mauling him, man. Making him a dirty. Just showing him, look, my boxing better than yours. And then when the fight went to the ground, Anthony Pettis looked lost. He looked lost. He looked like he didn't even know what to do in that situation. And I said, God, dog. Anthony Pettis finna get his ass whooped. And that's what happened. Uh, Nate Diaz did a good job of trying to transition from submission to submission. He couldn't get it, though, man. Anthony Pettis, I tell you what, man. I give him a lot of credit, man. His submission defense, was, it was on point, man. It was there. Um, and at one point, man, Nate Diaz in the third round was just beating his ass. Up to my had him beat up, and the referee should have stopped the fight. Anthony Pettis turned his back to Nate Diaz, man. Like, please, stop. Stop hitting me. Don't hit me anymore. I can't take it anymore. That's what it looked like, man. I tell you, man. Man. You know, man, you know how they run from the beating? Like if they turn their back, the beating just going to stop. Or the referee going to save them. No, no, Anthony. Anthony, the referee couldn't save you. Nobody can save you. You talked a gang of stuff, my PG-13 channel. You talked a gang of stuff, Anthony Pettis. You talked a gang of stuff, and man, 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 look what you did. You went in here, man, you got destroyed. You got pummeled. And then when Nate Diaz took him to the ground, he just... Nate Diaz just continued to onslaught the beating. But I like Nate Diaz, man. He was jabbing, man. He was jabbing Pettis to death. And you know, the, you know, Ho Rogan. Ho Rogan, they were trying to give Anthony Pettis so much credit for doing nothing. And I'm like, what fight are these guys watching? What fight is Nate uh, is Ho Rogan and Dominic Cruz watching? What fight, man? Nate Diaz was he was dominating the fight. Dominating. Dominating. Oh, good elbow by Anthony Pettis. Oh, did you miss all those shots that Nate Diaz? Hey, did you miss those five shots that Nate connected with? I think y'all did. You missed them. Did you miss that kick to the solar plexus by Nate Diaz? I think you missed it. I think you missed it, Ho Rogan. He did, too. Man, it was a good fight, though, man. But Pettis got taken to school, okay? Nate Diaz showed this dude no respect, got up in his face, and then, I'm going to tell you, man, Nate Diaz got up in there and called out Jorge Masvidal. Now that's gonna be a hell of a fight. You know that fight happening too. Cause you know in the UFC when you call somebody out, man. You know if you do it, hey, that fight gonna happen. I'll pay for that fight too. Diaz versus Masvidal, I'll pay for it, man. That'll be a good fight, man. Two, two thugs. Two street dudes. Now that's the best kind of fight. I got to see that fight. Man. Showtime Pettis didn't even show out. Showtime Pettis got showed up. And that's just the way that is. 